In this section, you will create a project in the engineer. Start the engineer. In the startup wizard, you define how you create a project. Open an existing project. Select a component from the catalog. Start with an empty project. The Engineer Online Help provides you with information on how to create a project via these steps. In this section, we'll use the convenient way of uploading data from connected devices. Activate the selection New Project Upload Data from System. Click Next. In the next dialog, you select the type of bus connection to the device. Since we are working with the diagnostic adapter, we can use the standard setting. Click the Start Search button. The engineer now searches for devices connected via the diagnostic adapter. The engineer reports the successful search. The engineer has found the 8400 Highline C inverter. Close the window. Close the startup wizard with Complete. The engineer must now upload the parameter data from the device detected. Start this process with Next. We have to wait for a moment until the engineer has uploaded all parameter data. You have now created a project. In the project tree, you can view the detected device with the detected extensions and the actuating drive speed application that is set for delivery. In order to complete the section, we'll now save the project non-volatilely in the device. You can then read it out from the device again anytime. For this, click the icon with the red floppy disk in the menu bar. Confirm this dialog with Next. The transmission will start automatically. After the transmission has been completed, you are in the Project Overview again. You can also save the project to the computer. For this, click the blue floppy disk icon. You have to go offline to save the project, therefore click Yes. Here you can enter the project properties. As designation, we select Training 8400 Highline. The other fields can be used to enter further properties for the project. We dispense with this and click Next. The engineer creates a project folder within which all project-related data are stored. Close the dialog with Complete. You are now in the Project Overview again. The project has been saved on your computer. Since we are offline, we must not forget to go online again. For this, use the corresponding button in the menu bar. You have completed this section successfully.